Hello, and welcome to King Posh's Garage. Today, I'm showing you this epic, best, wicked, absolutely fun, Drift Adventure Destroyer. There's so many great words I can say about this thing. Uh, this is my old drive drift tune for the Polaris RZR XP 1000. It is a 2015. It is an S1 class. Uh, it's a UTV. You can use it in a drift adventure and just completely wreck the lobby. It is a drift monster. Absolutely so much fun. I love the paint job on that I have on this thing. Oh, look at that. You can take off the... Uh, oh, look at that. You can put a bag in there or something. But you got Pickle Rick. Pickle Rick on this car. Pickle Rick is everywhere. He's on, like, the sides. He's on the front end. Um, you know, he, it's awesome. You know, you got Pickle Rick right there, too, you know. Yeah, I love Pickle Rick. Either way, this thing is great. I can't wait to show you guys this. Um, so let's get right into it. Show you guys what I've done to it. Show you the share code right off the bat. Uh, it's absolutely a blast to drift. You're going to have a lot of fun with this thing. Uh, it will dominate lobbies. And they'll all just be like, what just happened? What is that? What just beat me? Pick a Rick just beat you. That's right. So, you can tell it's got 668 horsepower. It only weighs 1,661 pounds. It is light. Here's the share code for that. What a great vehicle uh, to start off the new year. Then just to go into... A online room S1 class and spank everybody around you this thing will drift it will go sideways it will stay sideways it will be a lot of fun she's got a 1.6 liter uh, inline 4 turbo rally in there to get all that power pushing out that is a lot of power in this little thing it's got all-wheel drive of course this is an all-wheel drive tune it's got stock tire compound so you know it's going to slide all right that's what the original rims look like i went with the tc 105 n's they're the lightest rims in the game one of the lightest rims in the game even though i put 21 inches in the front and 21 inches in the back just to keep the tires as tight as possible we want this thing to slide like nobody's business and I achieved it. It's got a race transmission just to save weight. We did not go with the seven speed, anything like that. We wanted to just keep it as light as possible. We got the race drive line and we have a drift differential. So we got a posi drift tune on this thing. So it will drift. Race brakes, just so if you want to stop, you got a roll cage, even though it already has a roll cage on it. All right, and then everything here, of course, if you know the engine, it's fully built. I have everything on here the best I could and can get an 844. All right, this thing is a slider. It is the best of the best. So much fun. Uh, and, of course, to add on to slide, let's just put 55-55 on there. You know, heck, if they gave me the chance to put 100 and 100, I would put 100 and 100. Let's make this thing slide for days. And it does. She definitely slides for days. This is the uh, gearing that I came up with on this. It's got a 60, 0 to 60 in 3.8, 0 to 100 in 5.8. But who really cares about all that stuff? You're going sideways um, no matter what. Uh, now, I've used this tune in the past, uh, and it works even on this thing. Um, and it's, that's just the alignment, you know, the other stuff are going to be changed a little bit, uh, here and there, but it, it works. Uh, like the anti-roll bars are the same. 
as I would on, on a lot of my other cars, but hey, it works. You know, the springs, you couldn't do that. You couldn't do it like a 955, 936 um, with this uh, vehicle, uh, mainly because there's really no drift kit on it. And it's fine. You'll be fine without it. This thing is just fine. Um, you got 215 and 200. So it is on the stiff side. And it's as stiff as I possibly thought it should be. Uh, you got uh, ride height of 5.9 each. You got 7968 on dampening. Uh, there is no downforce to worry about. The braking, I have it at 70% to the front with 130% pressure. And then my differential is 76, 86, 97, 97 with 71% going to the rear. Guys, this thing is a points monster. You are going to absolutely love it. Um, you can get all kinds of stuff. You can get only 2,000 XP for owning this car. You can get a wheel spin, you know. This, this car, they didn't expect you to drift it. But I said, oh, oh, I'm drift tuning this. Mm-hmm. And I did. And it is wild. And it is fun. Uh, it is great on all the tracks. Doesn't matter if it's big, small, medium tracks. You're going to go sideways with this thing. And my little guy in there, he fits perfect in there. Little elf. Look at that second gear. Look how perfect that is. It, it doesn't redline right off the bat, you know? And even though it really doesn't have, I mean, it has the drift differential, this thing works. As you can tell, it is a slider. Okay, so if you're really looking for a car to make people be like, what in the world just joined our lobby? This, ladies and gentlemen, this is your vehicle. This is what you want. You're hardly going to see anybody rock this in a, uh, you know, in a, in a drift adventure. Hardly ever. In fact, let me even um, tell you even more. Like if I stop this thing, let me show you guys. Not many people have really tuned this car um, to the point of like, you know, the best handling. And whatnot. So if we take away my name right there and just leave Drift best for handling, I'm already number one in this. And there's only four other people that are using making tunes for uh, this vehicle. Okay, uh, and I'm already number one with it. So uh, if you're looking for something like you're, if you're tired of seeing the same old, same old, if, you know, cars out there, this is it. This is this is the car to rock um you're hardly gonna see anybody uh use one of these um and uh yeah you're you're gonna have a lot of fun with this you're just gonna just go into those uh drift lobbies and be like that's right that's right watch out nissans watch out toyotas watch out formula drift cars i'm here and I'm going to win. And I'm going to make you be like, ah, what just happened? Look at that. So easy. This is absolutely one of the easiest cars just to take sideways and just have fun. I know it's, a, it's not a car. It's a, uh, a UTV. Um, and it is just awesome. Um, I think you're going to have a lot of fun with this. I think you're going to um, wreck a lot of rooms. You're going to make a lot of people uncomfortable, jealous, upset. It could happen. It could happen. It, it, it could happen with this thing. You know, you could get some hate mail too. You know, all that, all that fun stuff that all of us love to hear. You could get it with Pickle Rick right here this this thing is just awesome um you know there we'll let that collect right there yeah sounds good enough but yeah you guys want something different something weird to take into an online lobby the polaris is your answer 
this thing is just weird. It's strange. It's easy to, to drift, control. I think you guys are going to have a lot of fun with this vehicle. I see this, I see this vehicle in like, you know, Bass Pro Shop and everywhere else. Um, it, it's a, it's a wild looking car or vehicle, you know, UTV. Um, absolutely, um, amazing little thing. So yeah. Well, hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. The tune, the build, the share code. Um, definitely try out my tune. I think you guys are going to have so much fun with this thing. Um, and I can't wait to hear in the comments of what you guys think of this. It is different. It is wild. Uh, it's a monster. Uh, it's it's going to put a smile on your face. That's, that's what it's going to do. Uh, I think it's going to put a smile on your face for sure. All right, guys. Well, hey, I hope you uh, enjoyed enjoy this tune. And if you did, definitely hit that like button. And I'll catch you guys next time. Stay sideways, my friends.